Okay, well. I do have more stuff in the ship that I haven't looked at yet. So I will look at that now. Yeah, the Ash Twin Project. The no may, no may, no my. I, I honestly don't know which it is. Apparently, in the community, it's widely like considered to be no my. Uh, like that's how it's pronounced. But I don't know. I prefer no may. I guess I don't know. The no may mined ore from this site to craft a protective shell designed to physically seal off the central chamber inside Ash Twin. Once the shell was finished, the no may checked to ensure there were no longer any physical entrances or cracks. The central chamber inside Ashtwin was physically sealed off by an immensely thick, thick protective shell. Yeah, I know there's more to explore. I could do more stuff with the Hanging City, I guess. But I also want to try going to Ashtwin. Yeah. Yeah, I want to go to Ashtwin. What am I seeing on my screen? What is that? What the hell? Is is that the, is that is that just the outer rock? Or a, a, am I seeing things? Wait, 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 wait. No, no, no. Is is that the quantum moon? The or the phantom moon? What Hold on. No, 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 no. Pause whatever the hell I was doing. I need to go towards this. Wait, no, no, no. Where'd it go? Oh, shit. I need to get out of the sun's vicinity. Where the hell did it go? No, it, it's right there. What happened in the, the landing camera? Why did it not show up? to slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. I don't want to go past it. Come on, match velocity, match velocity, match velocity. Match velocity. Here we go. No! What are you doing? What the hell? What is that? Where did it go? There it is. It just disappears off of my thing, so I guess I just need to go towards it and just try to not crash too harshly on it. No. So I'll just have to be very careful, I guess. Whoa! What the fuck? It, am, am I inside the... No, no, no. How do I land on it? 
Actually, I think this might be the phantom moon. Because it, it doesn't exist. Like, if I just go towards it... I just go straight through it and nothing happens. Okay, right, so I'm going to land on the Ash Twin. Sorry I spent so much time trying to figure that out. I was just so confused. First landing. Ah, uh, landing gear, god damn it. Ooh, another gravity cannon. What are you? Should I try and get on top of that? Yeah! Wait. Oh, there's another... Wait, no, 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 that's, that's, wait. No, 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 that's, yeah, no, that's Ember Twin. There's another Black Hole Forge rune on there. Oh, okay. Ugh. Can't, I can't go in. Damn. Well, I'm going to go get some oxygen and then try and go the other way instead. So don't go that way. Go this way instead. Yeah, there's something. Ah, uh, damn it! I should have brought. I should have brought the. Well, no, I don't have the disc anymore because I died by the ghost matter. I was gonna say I should have brought one of my discs, one of the Ash Twin discs, with me. What the fuck? That doesn't seem natural. Should I touch it? Oh my god! Whoa! Um... Um... Uh... Let, let me... Let me not get caught by that... Uh... Room. Okay. Whoa. 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 What the hell happened to you? Oh, hey, I can look at myself. Oh, my Jesus. It scared me. That was not there before. Uh, yeah, I can't do anything with this. It's also this room, which needs a scroll. Like, what the hell happened to this guy? I'm going to go up these stairs. Well, I'm not really sure if I would classify them as stairs, but... Is 
There's also a path over there. Um, that same room as before. There's nothing there. At least from what I can tell. Oh, here's a scroll. Oh shit, is that thing? Oh! Um... Oh god. Oh, where am I going? I don't even know where I am right now. Whoa! That just shot me out of the atmosphere. I'm on Ender Ember Twin now? <laughs> Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. That's kind of a problem. I was going to use this scroll over there, but I guess not. I saw a fire somewhere. Right there. Hold on. Hold on. This is... No. No. This is church area, right? Yeah. I only have three minutes of oxygen. Where are you? There. Hopefully there are trees over there. Uh, yes, another ship. And trees. Let's go. Let me set this down. I'm gonna roast some marshmallows. I haven't roasted a few in a while. Let me, let me try and do this correctly. No, it's burnt. Damn it! Ugh. I'll figure it out later. Mm. Oh, it's you! I take it your first launch went well then? Welcome to the Hourglass Twins. Mind the sand now. What are you up to? Hornfell's noticed our star charts are out of date, so I came here to update them. But something seems... How to put this? Off. I've seen, what, 10 supernovae by now? 12? They're in the double digits now, and, you know, that's... That's, you know, not normal. Not normal at all. Is there something you needed? I found something. Please do tell. I found your notes about the Outer Rocks main crater. Did you? I hope they were useful. The planet I mentioned may have been frozen solid or just partially made of ice like a much colder giant sea, but it's hard to say. It used to be the fifth planet in our solar system. You'll know you'll notice, of course, that there's no such planet now. And its place is Dark Bramble, which how to put this, grew into the space the fifth planet used to occupy. That is, Dark Bramble quite literally appeared at the center of the fifth planet and began destroying it from the inside out. Eventually, the planet shattered completely and its shards were flung across space. Some of these shards collided with the celestial bodies in our solar system, such as the outer rock, which I believe is how, our, how its biggest crater was formed. I have a question for you. Why are there so many... Why are so many stars going supernovae? I have no idea. Massive stars go supernova when they reach the end of their life spans, so it's possible that the stars are older than we realized. Or maybe our models are wrong and they don't live as long as we expected. Honestly, I'm not fond of either option. If our charts are wrong, what else is wrong? And our sun... No, I shouldn't jump to conclusions. I, I'm probably overthinking something. That's it. I just need to collect more data. What are you doing out here? Well, I was. That is, I originally came out here to update our star charts. Now, though, I'm trying to figure out what's going on with the stars. There are so many. Too many supernova. Why are so many sty stars dying out? I've never seen anything like this. Frankly, I'm worried and a little scared. Where should I explore here? To be honest, I haven't left this lake bed. 
I don't mean to brag, but I'm quite, I'm really quite good with the little scout. So I've been taking pictures of everything from right here in my campsite. You seen the old shipwreck site on Ember Twin's southern hemisphere, the one shooting a bright beam of light into the sky? It's not one of our own crashes, surprisingly enough. This one's a Nome ship. You'll find Nome ruins across the Twins, but strangely, not a single settlement. Believe me, if there was one to see, I'd have seen it with my little scout. So where do they live? Not on the surface, clearly. Ember Twin is full of cave systems, though. Maybe the answer lies underground? How dangerous is that big column of falling sand? On a scale of 1 to dead, I'd give it a give it a 7 or 8. Awfully pretty. Th it didn't kill me, it just sent me here. Right now, sand is flowing from Ash Twin to Ember Twin. But did you know the process eventually reverses? We're not completely sure why the sand flows back and forth between the twins, but it seems to be a natural enough phenomena. Natural phenomena. Well, if you'd like to see something interesting, check out the other twin once, uh, once a little more of its sand drains off. I promise you, you won't be disappointed. Just saying hi. Watch out for the stars. I mean, sand. Huh. Yeah, I would like to get back to my ship, but I don't think that's going to happen anytime soon. I could try and jump into the, the column of sand and try to get back, but that sounds extremely dangerous and I probably shouldn't do that. What the hell are these berries? I'm so confused by them. Ooh. Hey. Is that the Black Hole Forge sign again? Kind of looks like it. How do I get down there? Another projection disk area. You know what? Fuck it. I'm just gonna run into one of these berries and see what happens. Ow. Okay, so it, it's just like, it just damages my suit integrity, and then like, I lose oxygen quicker. I thought I heard something. Now this. This is fucking crazy. Now, how do I get in here? Well, that clearly didn't work. Ooh, sand. Oh. What 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 did I just hit? What just hit me? Did I hit like a wall or something? But I need to get through there. The sunless city. There has to be a way around. Crash site cave, 60 meters. It's kind of hard to see anything here. That's what my little scout is for. A portable battery. Or portable flashlight, actually. Well, I mean, technically, I do have a flashlight. But it sucks ass, so... <laughs> Sorry, flashlight. But the little scout is clearly better. You know what? I'll try one more time. There's nothing here, so... Look! 
Okay, all right, get ready. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, it just killed me. How did I survive it the first time? How how did I survive it the first time when it 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 slung me over to Ember Twin? All right. Well, I got I gotta go back. I, I got to go back because there were, there's a lot of stuff there. Oh yeah, I also got I also got some ship log update stuff. What? Church saw a Nome shipwreck shooting a beam of light into the sky somewhere on Ember Twin's summer, southern hemis hemisphere. Church has set up their astronomy gear on the north pole of Ember Twin. Chert has spotted an unusually high number of supernovae recently. Chert thinks the lack of surface ruins means the Nome must have lived some somewhere underground. I found a trail marker to for the for the the sunless city, but the path is blocked. Well, I'll try. Yeah, th this this little motherfucker, Phantom Moon. Not the Quantum Moon, not the one I actually want to go to, but the Phantom Moon. Luckily, I won't get distracted this time by trying to get onto the Quantum not the Quantum, the Phantom Moon. I won't get distracted this time. I promise. Well, I can't really promise that, but... Hold on, hold on. Where, where's the sand column thing? Oh, shit. This happens every time. I'm just so bad at landing my ship properly. Yeah, like, where'd the sand column go? It's just gone. I could also just be blind. That is also an option. Hello, son. Jesus, right. Where where the hell are are all the the little the glowy that sounds so stupid where's where's all the glowy shit where's all the nome shit to be more precise it's usually to the south so i'll i'll just go to the south i guess here it is here's more of the stuff sand column here yet? Whoa, what is this?
This actually looks like a, a Nome shuttle landing pad. Actually, see shit. Ah, oh, damn it! I'm back here again. Whoa! Stray comet. Ah, uh, there's the the sand pillar, sand column as. Um, sure, put it, but I'll call it the sand pillar instead. Oh, the sand is draining. That's what chirp meant. Jesus. Why are there so many berries? Oh! That scared me so bad. Oh. That's a jump scare and a half. Okay. Actually, I have three minutes of oxygen. I should probably go to my ship first. Okay, where is this? I don't know where this is. I'll figure it out. Because... There's that thing. I desperately need oxygen and I need to refuel. Yeah, there's also this path. is the path to here, but door broken, so I gotta go down. Oh, too close? Okay. Yarrow. Some time has passed since I checked in with you, Pi. How are you and Idea? Progressing with the sun station plans. Presently, my set. Oh. Um. I'll try to stay out of its path. Oh, I need to fix my suit. Oh. Jesus. Trying to no. I hate all these berries. They suck. Fuck these berries. Pi oh no, I need to my assessment is that our plan will either fail explosively or succeed explosively. Pi, you know I don't find that funny. How curious. Raimi thinks I'm a gas. And I don't recall requesting you monitor this conversation idea. Hypothesis. Time spent away from the station would be beneficial to you both. I'm immensely interested in testing your hypothesis, Yarrow. That, at least, we can agree on. Like, th that entire path is just blocked by berries. This area, too. How do I get rid of them?
I don't think I can just power through them. Holy shit. There might be a lower entrance somewhere, actually. Or the bridge. I'll walk along the bridge and see what I can find. Yeah, it just links these two sections together. Maybe this guy died by by the uh, the berries. I don't know if they're actually berries or not, but. Uh, yeah, I need to get in. Need to wait for that to pass. Alright, there it goes. Three minutes oxygen. I can get the scroll in that time. Or I can get to the I can get the scroll and then get back to my ship in time to refill on oxygen. I get anything new in the ship log? Yeah. Several large Nome towers form a ring around Ash Twins Equator. The Nome built something called the Sun Station, but not everyone supported its, its construction. I want to get to this. Hi, friends visiting from the Hanging City, we're planning the Ash Twin project at the High Energy Lab on Ember Twin's equator. Conoy, I became lost on Ember Twin, my gratitude Raimi, that Raimi found me, but the High Energy Lab is the building with the large solar panels. I'm surprised I didn't see it. I imagine our otherwise immensely clever Conoy would lose his own head if it weren't at a... <laughs> in an... Holy shit, why can I not say that word? And anatomically possible, impossible. Ah, uh, that again. What if I send a scout into it? Like, wait until it shows up. Like, going right there. What? What? No, 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 no. What? I did not sign up for this. I did not sign up for this. You motherfucker. Uh, two times this has happened. There might be other stuff to explore here, so. Oh, 
Whoa! What? What, what did I just see? I want to see if there's a marker here saying what this is. Nope, no marker. Unidentified signal? Whoa, what? Cave shard. Oh man, who is this yapper? Melloray. Uh, Coleus is missing. He vanished from the labeled the lake bed cave, the one at the the bottom of the dry lake bed at the North Pole several days ago, and we're unable, we're unable to find any trace of him. I don't know how much air he had when he disappeared, but how do I... Uh, I beg any friend reading this, help us recover Coleus. Melloray, this rock is very familiar. Did you travel here, my sedimentary friend? Because your unique color and texture appears identical to a rock I met earlier. Wasn't this same rock's fragment in the cave we found at the bottom of the dry lake bed at the North Pole? An update. Melloray and I went back to the lake bed cave and observed this rock again. Sometimes it's there and sometimes it isn't. This, this mean that means, oh, the rock from the beginning that, that is based on observation. If you look at it, it disappears. That means this rock wanders like the Kronten moon does. How curious. We plan to re-examine the northern lake bed cave. Maybe our friendly, friendly rock will meet us down there. No, it's still here. And there it goes. Wait a minute, this place is filling up with sand. Hold on, I need I need to go before I suffocate. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh god. Oh my god. Oh. 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 Holy shit. I need a second. That was so oh. oh my god. <sighs> props <laughs> sorry props to the to the to the developers for the sound design but that was s fucking disgusting to listen to like jesus <sighs> That has me freaked out a little bit, I have to be honest. The Ash Twin project was planned at the High Energy Lab, a building with a large with large solar panels on Ember Twin's equator. The Nome noticed a strange wandering rock that appeared that appeared in multiple caves on Ember Twin's northern hemisphere. I found a strange rock shard that moves when I'm not watching. It emits a signal on the quantum fl fluctuations frequency. The, the wandering rock was first spotted in a cave at the bottom of the dry lake bed on at Ember Twins North Pole. A nome named Coleus mysteriously vanished from a cave at the bottom of the dry lake bed at at Ember Twins North Pole. You know, I want to try my signal scope and using the quantum quantum fluctuations frequency. Uh, no, I don't care about that one. 
Yeah, the cave shard. There's one on Giant's Deep. Is this the um the one by the God, I hate that noise. I need I need to turn that off. That freaks me out. Wait. What? Wait, so let, let me go to this one first. Museum shard. And then there was also one over in that direction. Come on. I could have made that. Okay, here we go. God, this noise honestly really freaks me out. I, I don't like it a lot. I don't I don't like it very much at all, in fact, actually. It kind of scares me. Is it by the the seed where Feldspar is? Or Ow. I didn't mean to do that. Grove Shard. Museum Shard. No, no, no. Where's Grove Shard? Yeah, over there. It's always dark in the ancient glade. The quiet shade across old bark. Hold on, what was that signal I just got? Unknown. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna use this geyser to to get back up. Damn it. You know, I'm just gonna die. Yeah, I know. I know. This guy is dying in the most painful of ways. And it's all because of me. Do I feel bad? A little bit. There's a strange rock in this grove that moves when I'm not watching. It emits a signal on the quantum fluctuations frequency. I found a poem written on one of the trees in the grove. Well, you know what? I think I've done a lot this episode, and I'm starting to get very tired, and I want to go to sleep. So, next time, we're going to explore more. So, hope you guys have enjoyed, and I will see you guys next time.